Hi, YouTube. King of soy sauce here. Welcome to my new Warp Rain series, The Space Warriors. I started this game last year after watched some sick Warp Rain trailers. The swordman alike Warp Rain Excalibur was so cool. So I ditched Mag, Bolt, and start the Warp Rain game with him. The first mistake I made as a new player was, I picked up MK1 Paris bow over rifle or shotgun as my primary weapon. The charging Tigger is just too slow, and I was missing shots all the time. It makes the solo play so hard especially when you are surrounded. I end up gave up bow and just use melee weapon the whole time so I can save credit for better weapons later. However, Scanna on Excalibur is actually not bad. Things just got slashed into pieces. Warframe all have its specialties. Excalibur has a unique mastery in blade weapons. He has 10% increased attack speed and damage while doing damage with melee weapons such as swords, nakanas, rapiers, and dual swords. And check out the sick move he got since the start. Slash Dash. A very effective AoE ability, allowing Excalibur dashes through the enemies and cut them open. Slash Dash has lower energy cost you can spam it as many time as you can. It can also use as gap closer ability to travel. Your warp rain will not take damage during dash animation. Later on, I picked up Radial Blind. A slower player alike ability that briefly blinding all enemies within a small area. I noticed enemies got blinded can be finished with one stab, and in many surrounded situation, this is the perfect crowd control move to keep my melee only frame alive. Third abilities Excalibur picked up his Radial Javelin. I was so excited about it by reading the description. Impaling enemies to walls with javelins. How cool is that? But the truth is, the energy cost of the javelin is so high, you can burn all your energy within couple cast. It's not really sustainable. Finally, once Excalibur hit level 10, the ultimate exalted blade reveals his true power. Excalibur will forge a long sword with pure energy and dealing insane damage with it. Holding crouch, your Excalibur will become a turret, or holding slide while attacking, you can get many radial blind for free. Super useful in defense mission. The energy is so powerful can even travel distance, and cut through walls. To sum up, Excalibur, the Warp Rain lives up with his name. He's versatile and unique. Playing with Excalibur is full of brutal damage. I kind of felt like Excalibur is unstoppable as long as my energy bar is filled up. He's full of style too. Let's have a look some coloring variations. Give his primary a bit red, you will discover your own Deadpool. Add orange as primary and secondary dot coloring red for tertiary. The Iron Man is just forged in your arsenal. You will need a regalia to cosplay the arc reactor though. For new players. Just use the stalker's sigil. Set it 100% alpha or it will not glow as much. That's all for my first episode of the Space Warriors. Now I want to announce my first ever giveaway winner. The event was simple, 
subscribe to my channel and make a creative comment about why should you receive the 75 Platinum. I knew the response is a few compared to these very popular channels, but I feel happy for my viewers, you all have a very good odds to win the prize. Firstly, I want to give away the Neza set to the viewer who trying very hard to win the prize. Mr. Robert Walsh. Basically he told me half of his life story to convince me. Take it easy. Robert. It's about creative not about storytelling. But, I hope this Neza set can make your brother or you happy. And the most creative comment aka the 75 Platinum Award goes to, Mr. Kyo Cesar. He said I want to win because, I need to take my ship on a doctor, has a tumor inside her. He's referring to the recent overgrowth incidents happening to all landing craft. Thanks for everyone who participated to this event. Keep check back my channel for more Warframe videos and giveaway. And thanks DE team for free flat code. Thanks for all the viewers, please subscribe and I will see you in my next video.